Cato incident at, at the early exercise that is, takes place in the region. And it is, it's a good opportunity where the different countries can cooperate with one another in, in issues of not only security, but on, on emergency um, instances, for instance, like COVID, or if there's a hurricane. Um, so I think it's a wonderful exercise. We have countries from all over the region, including as far as Brazil and Canada. Mexico, for the first time, is co-hosting with Belize in, in this case. Um, at one time, I was told that the exercise was for four weeks. Unfortunately, you know, I think they've cut it down for, um, for two weeks. So we're very excited. We're happy that they're here. It's about a little over a hundred, I'm sorry, a little over a thousand soldiers that are going to be here doing this two-week exercise. We always have a, a standard. We say in the United States, train as you fight. So if I'm not going to battle the threat alone, I don't need to train alone. So, and then it's significant in that with Mexico being right next door to Belize, let's say if there's a, a threat that starts off the coast of Belize and moves through Belize, where are they going? They're going into Mexico. Or if they're coming from Mexico, coming into Belize. So if that lasts up between those two countries to have this exercise working together simultaneously lets everybody know each other and helps to counter those threats no matter which direction they may come from.